try to get a great night's rest, we eat right, we take care of our skin, but sometimes there's absolutely nothing you can really do. And for our next guest, Lisa, she said one body part clearly ages her more than any other. I'm here today because I just don't feel like my hands match the rest of the way I feel. I feel really good about myself and how I've kept myself in shape. However, my hands, they've lost their elasticity. The veins are starting to come to the surface. They look 60. I'd like my hands to match up with the way I feel. Hi, Lisa. Hi. Hi. Lisa is a perfect candidate for hand rejuvenation. As we age, our skin gets thinner and we lose some fat. I'm gonna be doing four insertions today. It'll be one here, another here, another here, and then last one. There. Okay. This is a topical numbing cream. Perfect. Okay. Let's get started. Fillers restore some volume under the skin. So I'm just massaging it and make sure that the filler is like evenly distributed everywhere. Oh, it looks great. So I'm gonna have you now sit on your hand. A combination of the pressure and temperature actually makes the filler nicely distributed under the skin. I'm gonna start injecting the other one. Alrighty. Alright. I can feel a little bit, but there's no pain. Let's take a look. Alright. Awesome. Look at that. What a difference. Alright. Thank You're you. Done. So Lisa put that hand rejuvenation procedure to the test. We have pictures of what her hands look like today, but first, Chief of Dermal Surgery at Mount Sinai, Dr. Khorasani, is on Skype joining us. Doc, thanks so Hi, much. Doc. But, but before we uh, ask you some important questions, I do want to share with our viewers Lisa's before and after uh, pictures, just so they can get an idea of how significant the change is. Definitely more volume there and, and much more youthful looking. So, you, Dr. Corsani, uh, something like this, obviously you're in injecting, how long will this last for Lisa? Yeah, it's a little different from patient to patient, but she should expect about 12 months of uh, the filler being there, for sure. You know, we talk about losing volume and fat. Over a certain age, and uh, you know, it's gonna be different for everyone, women, thin, thinner is not better. You know, we lose it from our face, we lose it from our hands, and then, by the way, it's very hard to put it back there. So, I, I actually think that as we age, that's one of the things we can look forward to. You know, maybe that five, three to five extra pounds, it's gonna help the hands. I mean, at least that's what I keep telling myself. Oh, but, and, and Dr. Corsan, you wanna ask you, how much, how much does something like this cost, if anyone's interested? You know, it depends how many syringes. Uh, Lisa had two syringes in each hand, anywhere from 1,500 to about 3,500. And Dr. Corisani, another message for everybody out there, just we talk about good skin care for our face, I think those same things hold true for our hands. 100%. Absolutely, you know, um, use your sunscreen uh, and moisturize, uh, you know, especially if you're in a profession, you're washing your hands a lot, that's that's gonna kill your skin. Dr. Corsani, thanks so much for joining us. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much.